and we have our correspondent Uche Okoro joining us live from Port Harcourt. Uche, we saw some of the uh, visuals you pushed to us. Tell us what happened behind the scene. Well, initially we drove past the residence of um, Joy Nunye, the street to her residence, that is, and there was little or nothing to um, warrant anything that eventually happened. We drove by a second time. We also weren't able to spot anything out of the ordinary. But on a second thought, just when, um, just about when we're about to give up, we decided to, you know, um, make a make a, a little more effort by going quite closer to the gate. And then, right when we were in front of the entrance into the compound, quite a number of policemen emerged and asked us to stop and um, saying that we do not have any business there and asked us to drive a distance off from the premises and park and wait for further directive. So that was the situation and while we were waiting to try to see you know, what was going on and get more information, the, the convoy of the governor drove by the same way we did the first two times to see what's going on and they circled the premises and um, the, the second time he drove by, he gained access into the premises and then, of course, there's been some communication between himself and the embattled Joy Nune. And it wasn't up to five minutes inside the compound and Joy Nune emerged from her residence, joined the governor in his vehicle and they drove off. Um, we understand that the very first destination that um, they made, that they headed to rather, was the River State Government House. Information, latest information available to me right now um, reveals that Joy Nunye right now as we speak is at the River State Government House. If there is any update, certainly that has happened within the last um, few seconds before I came on air. But I can tell you authoritatively that Gov um, Joy Nunye is in the company of Governor Yesun Wike at River State Government House right now as we speak. All right, just like you promised, keep an eye on this for us and we'll like to know whether she'll be able to make the committee on the NDDC, which is scheduled to appear today. Thank you so much, Uche Koro from Port Harcourt.